Hello everyone and welcome to episode 24, the final episode of the Idle Game Maker tutorial course where we are going to be uploading our game to both the Reddit and the Discord server so that other people can play and give feedback to our game. First of all, before we begin, I want to express my sincere gratitude to each and every one of you who have accompanied me on this Idle Game Making journey and your support and engagement throughout this course have been incredibly, incredibly valuable. And that brings me to my next point is that if you've enjoyed this series and want to stay updated on future content consider subscribing because it supports me a lot and ensures that you don't miss out on any future tutorials or exciting projects so thank you for being a part of this community and i look forward to continuing this journey with you with the future css tutorial course and a special other series that i have planned so without further ado let's actually get to uploading our game all right so first of all let's upload our game to the official idle game maker reddit page so once you've made a reddit account all you have to do is in the search bar type in our slash idle game maker and this right here is the official reddit page for idle game maker so once you're here you just hit create post and this is where you will create a post for your game now of course you can title this post whatever you want of course your game's name is preferable i'll just title this post coin mania release and it's also a good idea to add a brief description of your game in the description of your post. However, it's crucial that you include the link for your game, which can be easily located by just going into your game's page and then copy and pasting the URL. I'll just now cut to the part where I filled everything out. Now, when you filled out your post's description, all you have to do is click post. And after you did that, everybody can now play your game. Right, and now with our game uploaded to Reddit, let's upload it to the official Dashnet forums Discord server as well. I'm going to be uploading it here as well because this is the ideal place to post your game because this is where most people will play it. So first of all, you want to create a Discord account. You then want to join the Dashnet forums Discord server. The invite link is in the description. And once you join it, you will need to pass a sort of bot check, basically where you will have to verify that you are a real person. And after that, that this is what the server should look like so here you want to navigate into here this is the idle game maker forum and here it's basically a similar process as with the reddit where you just hit new post and give your post uh, a title you know title it your game's name i'll just title this coin mania and here you will once again create a description of your game however here you also have the option to add several tags into your game so in my case i will add the idle tag the clicker tag although you can add plenty of other tags and you can also add a custom thumbnail for your post or your game now if you are going to add a thumbnail for your game it's best to have it be sized somewhere around 512 by 512 pixels so I'm just gonna do that right away. There we go, I added my game's thumbnail. And now, same as previously, I'll just cut to when I have filled out the description of my game. Okay, so now, once again, I have filled out my post's description. And of course, don't forget to include the game link. Now, once you've done that, all you have to do is, once again, just hit post. Now your game is added to the forum of already existing games and anyone can now play your game and give feedback on it in real time. All right, and now that we uploaded our game, this series is now definitively concluded. However, we will further improve the look of our game with CSS in the upcoming CSS series, where you will learn tons of stuff about styling your game. From the bottom of my heart, I wanted to once again thank you for for supporting me in this journey so far and I'm looking forward to making future tutorials for you guys. Of course if you have any questions feel free to ask them in the comments and with that said thank you very much for watching make sure to like comment and subscribe and if you really enjoy what I do here consider checking out my patreon for only two dollars a month you can get some pretty nice perks or don't watching my videos is already enough so once again thank you for watching and I'll see you in the next one.